Hello everyone, today I want to show you how to format table borders uh, with macro. So for example, uh, this is a table with out any border that we have right now and then we kind of want to uh, change it into this format so of course if you just do it without a macro you simply go to um, the borders and then do it accordingly but then there there's always going to be times when you want to do it with macro um, and i'm going to show you the cost of, of how to do that Okay, so now we have opened the macro um, editor and here is uh, basically the codes to do it. So um, I have um, added three types of, uh, of lines of borders to the table. So the first and I'm going to explain to you. So the first, as I noted in the green comment, is added a dotted line. And I want to apply the line to the range I7 to N7, which is I7 to N7. Um, and then I want to apply it to, uh, to the bottom of the edge and then I want the style to be dot. So this is the first uh, request I have. Uh, the second request I have is that I want to add a thin line to range I8 to N8. And I want it to be at the bottom at, uh, of the cell border. I want it to be the continuous, which is the most common type. And I want it to be thin in terms of the weight. So this is a demand, uh, the command to do that. And then the last command here is that I want to add thick line, um, both to the top of the range I7 to N7, which is the top here. Um, and also to the bottom of the I17 to N17, which is the bottom of this, uh, the table. Uh, and as you can see, I, I've defined it as the top and that the line style is continuous and the weight is sick. Um, and the same for the bottom one. So this is basically the code to run for uh, the table border. So now we have, we have the code ready. Let's run it and let's see what happens. So yeah, so this is exactly how we create the border uh, as we desire for, um, for your data table with macro. And I hope that you like it. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you like it. If you have any question, please leave me a comment and I will talk to you very soon.